What's up guys? It's King Daddy Dmac and welcome back to another episode of Hermitcraft. How is everybody doing today? I'm doing quite nice. I'm pretty excited. Got a lot going on. We're going to do, it seems to be working out pretty well. We're going to work around the base for a little bit and then we'll get into detective mode uh, in about 10 minutes or so. Anywho, I am super duper excited. I hope this all works out. I finally finished setting up all these guys over here to start working on our second quadrant of clearing out. I'm going to say this wrong, so I'm just going to look. I just finished filling all the dispensers, the lava. Hopefully, the redstone's all going to work out. These guys, remember, remember when we were playing with them? They're a little, they're a little weird. They're a little weird. When you, when I flip the, the lever lever, it'll let out the lava. Just like so. But then with these guys, you got to flip it then again to turn it off. So hopefully the way I have it set up works. I'm just going to call myself out a little bit. I probably should have tested this first. I'm a little nervous that having repeaters right up next to it might give it, for some of them, like a double click or something weird, which could mess a whole lot of things up. But hopefully it won't. And this is just newbie, newbie, newbie redstone. But what could be more fun? All right. So you ready, guys? Are you ready for this? Are you ready? Oh, please work. All right, everything's looking good. Oh, baby. Feel that frame rate. Come on, come on. I see a little spot there that you didn't get. I already see a little spot. That's okay, that's okay. All right, let's, let's look around. Let's see what it does from the other side. Mm, it looks pretty good, to be honest with you. I'm sure there's going to be a couple spots we'll have to put in more of the uh, dispensers. There's dispensers, right? I already forgot. Oh, no! Don't go on fire! All right, so that doesn't shut them off yet. Is everything, everything off? Okay. Then we flip it again, and that should shut them all off. And then flip it again, and it's still all off. So it'd probably work out better maybe with like a button. Little, little hesitant about trying it quite yet with a button. But hopefully that should work out. Now, as you may remember, ooh, that looks pretty good. A couple spots I can already see. This first row is a little, little annoying. Let's see, did I do this all with class already? Yes. All right, this first first level is a little annoying because I don't have any room to walk. So I'm going to try and get it all cleared out. I got to do it from underneath. All right, but there's no lava. It's safe at least. And so let me bang through this and we'll do maybe like one or two more. I think that should be good. So I will, I will see you guys back. Holy moly, that took a little bit of time. All right, so did the hardest, the hardest level. We should be able to do it now with our super fast mining. All right, so let's try it again. Let's drop out the lava. Looking good, looking good. I think I fixed that one little spot in here. Hopefully, hopefully. Yeah, it was right there. All right, cool. Yeah, I just had an extra piece of glass there. All right, so let's flip it here. All going off. And then now it should retract. All right, I think we are all good in the hood. Let's just see, let's just see. Looking good. Oh, baby. All right, so this should now be a piece of cake to get all cleared out. Let's see, can I do a little drop in maybe like right here? Is that good? Sweet! So now let's do super fast mining. I'll, I'll end off there. We'll start off on this side. 
Now, I do have to be a little bit more careful this time around, just because last time we had all the lava to be light while doing this. Now, we don't really have anything, so mobs could be spawning in like nuts. Let's see, I think I can get three of them. Yes. Oh, baby. So much better. So hopefully I can bang through this pretty quickly. Probably not going to finish this whole level this episode, but I'll keep you guys updated on progress. Let me see if there's anything else around the base. It's been a little, a little weird this week. I had a good friend. Oh, yucky. You already get mob spawn in. A good friend that broke up with his, um, more or less wife. It's his girlfriend, but they own a house together, which is kind of a mistake, but... In any case, yeah, they broke up, and he's having a really hard time. Really good childhood friend of mine, who I actually hadn't spoke to in years. But, um, it's really good hearing from him. And this last week, I spent a bunch of time being the good friend, hanging out with him. And it got a little bit in the way of, of recording. So I feel really bad about that. But today, we are actually going to reveal... Hopefully. Hopefully. We'll see. We'll see what happens. But, uh... Hopefully, all that footage from the past, you know, of the security cameras, hopefully that all rendered out. I'm really curious to, like, see all the different stuff that could have happened. Because I suppose there's a chance that, you know, other than just the robbers, who knows what else has been going on in the server in that time that we could have picked up footage of. kind of thinking it could be kind of silly. <gasps> oh, 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 oh. Oh my god! I don't have a bow and arrow either. So bad. Oh, can we get? Can we get? Maybe a record? No. Oh, oh my goodness! Not gonna take that chance. You know, I bet you getting records would be easier to do in the water. All right, buddy. So even skeletons might not be. Oh, this is a nightmare. Dish is a nightmare. Mob spawning in off the woods. Ooh. Great. Yeah, yeah, yeah. Alright, I better hurry this up. I'm gonna keep the recording going just in case something goofy happens. Oh, a little scared. But anyway, after this, I think I'll just do a few more layers myself. And then let's get over to the detective agency. Let's see what's going on. All right, I think we got some pretty good progress. We went around, but down about five blocks. I only got seven durability on my pickaxe. Yeah, I uh, left. So I think as the sun sets, I'm going to make my way over to New Hermiton. Let's throw this in here just so we can get that healed up for next time. Grab wah wah wee wah. And yeah, let's get some detective work started. All right, guys, we are in her new Hermiton. What's going on? What's going on? I just checked. We don't have any new mail. Well, actually, we got we got a new edition of the Hermiton Herald. It's pretty cool from Cleo. If we have time, we'll go through it. If there's anything important. How you doing, Carol? He's still shooting down Spum. You know, he's not a bad guy. I should give him a chance. <laughs> All right, um, let's see here. So, oh my goodness, so much going on. We had, in the past week or two, we had a riot going on out here. A whole bunch of zombies. Maybe I can show a clip of that, because I do have it. I wasn't able to fit it in the last episode. It was pretty funny. We've got Spum's uh, Muse Meats. was shut down because it was all dirty and had all sorts of nasty nasty stuff going on cruelty to animals we don't want it <laughs> we have let's see what's going on back here we have the better or no better <laughs> shops going on oh my goodness um woo mumbo set up the same i think the same exact shop for hay bales that exumavoid did except he's I think he's charging like one less diamond or maybe more. I don't know. It's it's all it's all craziness down here. Competition. And speaking of competition, what the heck is this? Corralis 
fried chicken going up right next to our McDonald's. Can you believe the shenanigans we leave for just a little while, a little while. And he has the nerve to not only set up a sign that looks probably, yeah, I'd say better than ours. But on top of that, he actually starts to get the store installed. The, the whole shop? We gotta get going. This this detective agency. Thank you, by the way, Carl. So I really needed that. Um, our detective agency is freaking taking up all of our time. So we gotta get to McDonald's soon. Oh, that dirty, dirty bad boy Corrales. Um, speaking of which, also, I know we've been putting off the whole rent to dirt Um, Corrales has been a little bit busy. He wasn't able to fit it in. For last week but I should have time this week to sit down and record with my derp you know because we rented Corrales so we'll get that going don't worry guys I'm trying to get him over as soon as possible but we'll get that done this week so hopefully next episode hopefully but anyway let's get our detective hats on let's get ready Did I still not change this uh. Let's get our detective hats on. Let's just make sure no new cases. There's this weird book that was in here. Christmas, somebody lost it or maybe forgot. I don't know what the deal is with that. You guys let me know in the comments. But other than that, let's get back to the cases. And just to remind you, we're working on Pungence, Schism, and Hypno's case. And that's as far as the Abbot Caving stuff being stolen. If you haven't watched the last few episodes, I recommend you go back to see what's going on so that this all makes sense. And then after that, we also got the whole name tag case that we got to that we gotta get going on. What's going on? He's blaming Cleo for stealing name tag. But I don't know. It kind of sounds like he might have just lost name tag himself. But anyway, we shall see. Let's return. Yet another sleepless night here on the Hermitcraft server, there is an eerie chill going through the air. Unsolved mysteries. We are so close, last time, unraveling this case, but I just couldn't help. Not, <laughs> I, I, I just couldn't sleep knowing that the case was left unsolved. We are so close. People are, the town's people are, are on each other's back. Chaos going through the air. I think it's time that we solve this case. That we finally find who our culprits are. It could be anyone. And I think this is what is causing all the turmoil on the Hermitcraft server. So let's go. We have our cases. We have all of our cams. Let's go finally see what this footage unveils. All right, guys, Detective DMAC Dick on the case. Let's go find out what's in this footage. I know last time we looked and it looked like the footage from the past, it took a while to be able to transfer over, to be able to render in. But by now, given this much time, we should be able to actually view this footage. Now, let's go over to our local cinema. Compliments of Plungeons. And hopefully we can watch it on this. I didn't even think about that. What on earth would we watch this with? So why don't we set up a little projector type thingamabobber. I've never done this before, so I'm not sure how it's going to turn out. Somehow I have a feeling it's going to look very similar to what our actual video cameras looked like. All right, so a projector, projector, ooh. Let's see, okay, okay, we're getting somewhere. All right, I think that's looking good. I think it's starting to look good. Maybe, maybe we can put on, we need to have something to tell whether it's on or off, okay. Maybe, maybe that could work. I don't know. It looks pretty, it looks pretty bootleg. I don't know. All right. 
getting somewhere, then we're going to have to have it to turn on and off. Um, all right, I think that can work. Then I think if we load our footage in, let's see, cam one, two, three, and four, it should be able to play all the way through. We may need to make a pause, but let's see. Is it rolling? Is it rolling? I have to get a little bit closer. All right, let's get ready for the film. Abba tournament. Ooh, I know there's some stuff in this chest. I gotta check out what I'm gonna get when I win this. Oh man, there is so much good stuff in here. Ooh, these diamonds are nice. Oh yeah, these are gonna be in my chest. I won't have to go mining again. It's gonna be so good. All right, well, I should probably put these things back. Hey, what is that? When did the heck when did the camera get put here so weird huh oh well i need to get ready for my next match come on boy come on good name tag i know i know it's it's been hard it's it's really been hard i can't i can't i think the abuse you must have suffered I mean, I've seen what he's done to his old horse. I mean, it's just terrible. I can't, you know, there's no way I can let you stand there and, and take that sort of abuse. You know, the last, the last name tag, he died in lava. It was terrible. I, I was, I can't take it anymore. You deserve better. I think, I think you do need to be free. And I, I can't keep you and I can't take you with me because you just have to go back to him. I think I think you need to go. You need to run and be free, and uh, just not put any put up with any Corallis abuse. I I just breaks my heart. See, go free. Whoa, 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 whoa. Hold up. Hold up a moment. Hold your horses. Oh my goodness. Oh, so we went through the first two videotapes and oh my goodness. So, so far we found out Hypno thinks he's going to win. Little does he know. Little does he know. Past Hypno. But we found out what happened to name tag. Oh, it brought a tear to my eye. It was so beautiful. It ends up Cleo did steal name tag. I can't believe it, but it wasn't really a theft. It wasn't really a theft. She was actually saving name tag. Oh my goodness, saving him from the evil. 
the evil clutches of the animal abusing Corrales. <laughs> oh, I can't believe it. That is, that's a case solved. That is an actual case solved. Now everyone knows what actually, what actually happened to name tag. I didn't think we'd ever solve that case. Oh my goodness. Thank goodness. Thank goodness for these past tapes, for these hidden surveillance. Anyway, let's get going. Let's take care now, now, of the video three and four. All right. So let's, let's flip it back on. And let's watch the rest of the tape. Will it unveil who the robbers are? Hey, you ready to steal? I'm ready to take what's ours. We're gonna cram some stuff into this donkey. You know what? I'm gonna leave some iron scattered in the chests. Yeah? Yeah. Alright, come on. Open up the chests, stuff your pockets full, baby. Give me that stuff, that's my stuff. <laughs> okay, hang on. Winning's chest, reserved for winner. I don't think so. No, no, no. Uh-uh. Winning's chest. Reserved for... Let's see. Who's a sucker on the server? I know. Schism and pungence. Yeah. We are totally suckers, they are. <laughs> they are real big suckers, I am. They are. <laughs> We're gonna get them, baby. We're gonna get them. Ha! They won't you wanna... know what hit them. Hey, what's your favorite type of poem? Um, you know what I hate? What? Haikus. I hate haikus. Right one. Okay. <laughs> okay. <laughs> I will do that. I'm gonna feel so dirty writing this haiku. Write it. T t teach me a haiku. <laughs> first. Teach me a haiku. That's the first. <laughs> the... The, the, the future and past can get so murky. Sometimes haikus change. <laughs> Teach me a haiku. Future Dude. haiku is different. <laughs> Dude, it's time to go. Five syllables. Horse. Dude, cops are on our trail. Yo, yo, go. man. Yo, yo, come on. Yo, yo, forget the cops a second. Come up and look at this. Nice. What is, what is this? A great haiku? Oh. Nah, man, come on through the window. Oh! Crap, it's gonna blow our cover. What are we gonna do about it? What is it? Some sort of, is it a box? It's a, it's got surveillance. Does it have a Happy camera. Meal inside? Surveillance. Shh. Surveillance camera? It might still have a Happy Meal inside, though. Okay. I wanna, cause I'm really, can we get a Happy Meal on the way back? Yeah. Um, okay. Can you take yeah. donkeys through, can you take donkeys through, through a drive through I think so. Um, okay. Can I have the toy? Can we're splitting the toy. Oh. Make sure okay. you get a boy make sure you get a boy toy. If you get a girl toy, I swear to god, I'm gonna lose it. Dude, the girls get the best toys. What do you want? A girl toy? You want a you want a frozen toy? I like frozen. You didn't even see the movie. No. But I it looked charming. Prince Char Get the okay. bust, bust, bust the camera. <laughs> I busted it. Okay, good job, Bustin. Thanks. It's I all just buzzed now. the lens out. <laughs> <laughs> okay. Okay. There's something. Is that it? Do we do it? <laughs> right. <laughs> Why am I recording this? I'm so god. I'm... <laughs> <laughs> I recorded it too. Yeah. <laughs> Let's bust out of here. Yo, let's go, man. We gotta cheese it. Dude. Where's cheese the donkeys? It. Cheese it. Under here. Where, where's the donkeys? They're right here. Oh, yeah. Yes. Ride. Ride like the wind. Okay. <laughs> <laughs> Fake donkeys. Man, I'm glad that camera had a Happy Meal in it. You know, it didn't even taste like old camera. Who knew? You just look inside cameras and you get french fries and a Coke and some chicken. All fresh, too. Mm-hmm. Didn't even taste like old camera. Mm-mm. And we Dude. got a toy with it too. I, I told you I'm, I'm gonna lose my mind. 
Shoot the camera, good job. I got it, bullseye. Mm -hmm. <laughs> Dude, I told you to ask for the boy toy. I like the girl toy because it's got moving parts. <laughs> Is that good? Oh no! That's it? It's over? Who were those two shadowy figures? Oh my goodness! Are we going to be able to figure out who that was? Who were those two? And what were they doing on the Hermitcraft server? It didn't look like anyone I knew. Who do you think the culprits were? We have them on tape. Maybe it needs more time to render, more time for the tapes to finish their uh, developing. I don't know, or maybe they were wearing some type of secret, secret uh, clothing that disguised themselves. I don't know. You let me know in the comments, who was it? Could it have been Biffa and Exumavoid? Could it have been Hypno and Slipgator? Who knows? Maybe it was even generic B and B double O. Well, he may never know, but we'll have to uncover it next time. If there's any way, I don't know, you guys are gonna have to give me any tips on how. So, make sure to leave all that stuff in the comments. And guys, please make sure to leave a thumbs up on the video if you enjoy it. It helps me out oh so much and gets me motivated for more of our epic, silly, crazy Hermitcraft adventures here in Vanilla. So remember to leave that thumbs up because I love it. And uh, until next time, guys. D Mac, Detective Dick D Mac, out. Peace out.